So Zeta is rumored to have an upcoming airdrop on Solana, and if it's anything like the Jito token, it'll be worth thousands of dollars. So Zeta is a perpetual DEX built on top of Solana with over 14 million total value lock. There's a ton of speculation on X on when the airdrop will happen, so investors have been providing millions in liquidity to improve their chances for an airdrop. So today I want to cover the complete Zeta platform and how to use the various functions within the app in order to increase your chances for an upcoming airdrop. We have a lot to cover, let's get started. So like I mentioned, Zeta is a perpetual DEX built on top of Solana and it lets you trade all your favorite assets at lightning speed without compromising security. So the website is zeta.markets and you would click on trade now. And if for some reason you can't access the website from your country, I do recommend you use a VPN in order to bypass this. So the homepage would take you to the trade tab and you want to connect your wallet, I do recommend using the phantom wallet, connect and you are auto connected. And if you don't have that installed, visit phantom.app and make sure you load some Solana into your wallet from your favorite broker. I already have some Solana loaded into my phantom wallet. So the Zeta platform does not have a token yet, so investors are anticipating an airdrop. And anytime there's a point system on a DEX, that is a good indicator that an upcoming airdrop is happening. So on the Zeta platform, they call this the Z-score. You can click here and find out what the Z-score is. So Z-score is a curtain raiser to the launch of our token. The higher your Z-score, the better the rewards. You earn Z-score based on your trading activity on Zeta. The more you trade, the larger your Z-score. And this is a giant hint that an airdrop is happening. So with that being said, you definitely want to make trades daily on the platform to increase your Z score and in turn that will increase your chances for a higher airdrop. So the first thing you want to do is deposit some USDC, hit deposit. Now, like I mentioned, I only have Solana in my wallet, so we're going to have to swap some Solana for some USDC. There is a built-in DEX powered by Jupiter, so you will hit swap and deposit. And let's just say we want 20 USD, so that is the exchange rate for Solana. We'll go ahead and hit swap. Make sure all the information looks correct. Hit confirm. Confirm the transaction. Great, that was successful. There is 20 USD. Hit done. So if you look under portfolio, we see our account equity is 20, but there is leverage available on the platform, a 10x leverage. So 20 times 10 is $200 worth of buying power. So let's make a trade. The way perpetuals work is you're either long on a coin or you're short. So long meaning you're bullish on the token. You believe the price of the token will rise over time and short would mean you believe the token will fall in price. Obviously I'm bullish long term on Solana so I will take a long position. So order type is market. You take the live spot price at the moment of execution. The limit is a pre set dollar amount of the token price. Once that price is reached, the order will be executed. Let's go ahead and for this example, let's go ahead and do market. So for Sol, let's go ahead and enter 0.02 and you can choose the amount of leverage you would like. So notice as you increase your leverage, your liquidation price increases. So I'm going to keep it conservative at 2.4. So the liquidation price would be $60 per Solana token. If you look at the live current market price, the token's at $98. So feel free to play with this lever and you can increase the leverage or decrease the lower the leverage the safer the bet and when you're ready you would hit buy sold perp they confirm and your order was filled so now if you scroll lower on the page your open long position is down here quantity value entry price and liquidation price and you can even customize a tp meaning take profit or sl stop loss order so click here and let's say you want a target price of 110 for solana you want the whole position sold out of profit that's your estimated profit five dollars and 55 cents you would hit sell confirm cool that was confirmed so now you have green icon here meaning the take profit limit order is in place vice versa you can also trigger a stop loss so let's say at $90 I want to cut my losses so if Solana reaches $90 I could also enter that and sell all of that position at 100% so the estimated loss here would be $4.45 it's sell confirm so for this specific position I have two limit orders pending and I definitely want to take profit if it triggers at 110 or I want to cut my losses at 90 so you hover over here and it gives you specific pricing data and if for some reason you want to completely close a position, you would click on close and close this out. So I'm interacting with the app as much as I can in order to increase my Z-score. And you can also take bets on other tokens such as Bonk. So you can do the same with Bonk. Let's enter one Bonk here. You can go long, market price, increase or decrease your leverage and place the position. So if you hover over to a portfolio, this would show you your performance in history. And because this account is new, I don't have much established yet, but you do 
reducing my open position down here. You can also withdraw your funds from here. Now under leaderboard, this shows you the history of trades happening on the platform and also the top 50 traders currently trading. So as you can see, we have some crazy Z scores happening. 2 million, 2 million, 1.8 million. So a lot of active trading happening here. So the leaderboard updates every hour. So after your first hour, your rank will happen here. And again, the idea is to increase your Z score to get a bigger airdrop. So you earn one Z score for every $1 of taker volume. And under more, you'll find documentation regarding the platform, some tutorials, and you can join their Discord. So this is a pretty straightforward DAX. The idea here is to have fun with it and increase your Z score. So you can stay up to date with everything Zeta related on their official X page at Zeta Markets. And don't forget to check out my other Solana airdrop tutorials on my channel. So what do you think about Zeta? Are you a fan? Let me know in the comment section. And as always, if you have any questions, please leave a question in the comment section. I'll be happy to respond. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you on the next one.